Hey, and welcome to Adventures by D. We are back at Smoky Mountain Christmas in Dollywood, the 2021 version. It's a mother-daughter weekend, mm -hmm. and we're dressed as some characters. We're bringing in the Christmas spirit, and it's opening night. We're gonna bring it all to you, all the lights, all the fun. What, anything else, Madison? Uh, it's supposed to be really cool tonight, so we decided to come in onesies, because why not? Why not? So she's the Christmas story bunny theme, and I am elf in all the glory. So join us on our Christmas Dollywood adventure. Beautiful. There's nothing like a Dollywood Christmas with butterflies, right? So we're first heading into Reds, because I know from last year there's some pretty good Halloween stuff in here. We're heading into... You mean Christmas stuff? Cri <laughs> <laughs> we're heading what season into, is it? We're, we're heading into the Reds area to look at all of the Christmas decorations. As I know from last year when I was here with my dad, there was some pretty good stuff in here. Old-timey Christmas. Mm -hmm. This is just like at Six Flags over Georgia. Yeah, it, it does run the diner. Set up with them too. Super cute. The carnival games have switched so you can win Christmas themed items. And we've seen people walking with huge Santa Claus. It's like they're the size of people. And also there's somebody over here that won one of these candy canes. I don't know if you can see it there, but like there's huge candy canes to win and bears and everything. So cool. Madison really wants to win one of these guys, but I don't know what we do with it. What do you say, Madison? I say we give it to her. Oh my gosh. Here, let me get a look at you and full splendor. There she is. She's a fluffy bunny from a Christmas story. Here, you wanna shoot me? Yeah. All right, let me check off my mask real quick. All right. Who am I? Oh. near the Tennessee tornado they've now turned this into food truck park where you can place orders and get food it's a great idea because there's such a demand to eat in here that's a great idea right yeah yes oh we're coming to see some of the best parts of Smoky Mountain Christmas and you know we're here for the lights we're also here for the music so we're hoping we can catch a couple shows Look how pretty that tree is. Like they got it decorated all the way to the top. Wow. Mass and this tree is even more impressive in person than what you and daddy showed last year. Holy cow. And people are just gathered around it waiting for the show. So Maddie, what do you think of the light so far? Really cool. Yeah, they're so awesome. That uh, walk with the twinkling lights underneath to music, it's like beautiful. 
we're going to play some carnival games hopefully in a few minutes and try to win you a life size Santa. Yeah. No, I don't know if that's possible. Yes. And then this tree is amazing. Oh yeah, and we did Blaze and Fury too. That was fun, right? Yeah. Always got to fit that in. Right. On to the next. Did you notice her coat of many colors was on the tree? Did you oh, notice that that was all the different colors? It was her coat of many colors. Oh, that made more sense. And then there was a... They have luminaries out here outside a mystery mine. Cool. Did you even notice that? Over here too. On both sides, heading up to Wildwood Grove. No, no, I didn't. Here we go. What do you think's in Wildwood Grove, Madison? Christmas lights. Christmas lights? Yeah. All right, let's see. We're going to stop for some sweets and treats in Wildwood Grove. Looks like we have floats, dip cones, waffle cones, chocolate vanilla swirl. You can add toppings. They have sundaes. What do you think you want, Mad? What you got there, Madison? Vanilla waffle cone. It looks kind of... <laughs> looks like it's about to go down, right? Yeah. And I also got a hot chocolate. We got a couple of waters. I'll tell you what, that gold pass saves you a ton of money. Not necessarily Christmas, but here is the infamous butterfly tree in Wildwood Grove. You remember the last time we saw this in the evening, Maddie? It was filled. It was filled with people, and what was it? Remember, it was their summer night light thing. Yeah, the drone thing. Yeah, the drones, and we were here for opening night for that. Look at that. It's really cool. That tree, it like changes colors, and it looks like the butterflies are flying. They have some trees lit up along the walkways. And most importantly, we're the type of family that we get ice cream when it's cold, right? <laughs> How much money do I have to pay you to get on the drop tower with me? Uh, there is no amount of money. You're just saying. <laughs> I will wait down here for you. No, you won't ever do it alone. In a clearing, deep in the forest, under the mist of the beautiful butterfly mountains, show? grows the ancient wildwood tree. Perched on a mighty stone base, with roots that reach deep into the earth, it spreads its branches wide. Make a postcard perfect background. 
while at home, we cover our tree with colorful lights as the smell of sugar cookies and the music of the season fills the air. And as the stars come out for the night and the moon climbs high, little ones give in to sleepy Christmas dreams. And we know that soon enough the sun will rise and we'll celebrate a day filled with joy. The next morning, love and laughter, surprise and delight all seem to arrive wrapped in bright, shiny paper. And sparkly eyed children are tickled that their dreams came true. While special memories are made for moms and dads, too. You see, there's really nothing quite like being home for Christmas. So trim the tree and wrap the presents, turn the Christmas music on. Star shone true and bright. Angels proclaimed a wondrous sight, and the world was filled with love. We hope the spirit of the season rings out loud and clear and becomes part of your heart song forever. Well, color me surprised. Well, you there's something back here. I know. Look at that. I had no idea this was back here. I was going to say, color me surprised, Dolly gave us a heart song Christmas back here in Wildwood Grove. Did she not? That was really awesome. Yeah. I really enjoyed that. I might have actually enjoyed that one better than the other tree. And the LED tree was really good too. Mm -hmm. That was a very nice surprise because we had no idea this went on back here. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to enjoy some hot chocolate and then we're on to the next thing. Yes. Somebody's a little scared to ride the scrambler. So my mom was a little chicken to ride the scrambler. She got on and then she left. So it's only me. Last time I did this, I was with my dad. <laughs> oh my God. Madison I don't know a good two minutes and I watched you from out here because I thought I was gonna get really sick and I got off Scary I'm cat. Bark, 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 chicken. <laughs> but that's okay cuz I'm here and I'm feeling good versus feeling green as my I didn't want to feel as green as my elf outfit so yeah was it fun yeah awesome you look pretty this area is actually decorated much better than I thought. I actually think it's decorated better than the Wildwood Grove area.
Look at the mist in here. I'm trying to decide which is my favorite. This might be my favorite area. is calling your name. Always love a good fireworks show. Some of the, there was one that was like a waterfall that was really cool. Definitely come to Wildwood Grove to watch the fireworks because they're shot off behind it. Everything is decorated here, you know? We haven't printed one all year, so this is the one we're getting. They're all three were actually pretty cute. So excited. Madison, we're all done. We saw the fireworks. Mm -hmm. We saw lots of lights. We saw a couple of shows. That's right. What did you think? It was fun. Tons of fun. I just wish we'd had more time, right? Yeah. So um we needed to get here earlier in the day. If you want to see the singing shows and see all the lights, 
Uh, you're gonna have to come earlier in the day or come for two nights. Uh, and we missed the train. We were so close to getting on it and we missed it by like two minutes. So the last ride was at eight o'clock for the train. What'd you think, Madison? Was it as fun as last year? Um, I mean, it's different. We got to see fireworks, which was cool. Yeah. Worth the trip? Yeah. Beautiful. Weather's great. Onesies kept us warm. We had a ton of fun. Mm -hmm. So with that, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. We have a playlist of all things Tennessee adventures. And we've been to Dollywood six times since Christmas of 2020. So opening, Christmas, summer, their um, flower festival, flower and garden festival. The drone. The drones. We've been here for all sorts of things. Mm -hmm. And we've seen their main street transform. <laughs> like right now, it's Christmas behind us. Look at it. I remember doing this spin when there were umbrellas above my head. Madison, with that, what do we want to say? May, May the, the adventures, adventures be, be with you. you. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and ringing a bell. So you'll be notified of our next upload. And as always, may the adventures be with you.